Hey everybody, this is Brad from Johnson Small Engines. Just want to go over how I start a two cycle machine. This is a steel HF45 hedge trimmer. One of my customers had it and he couldn't get it started last year. This thing sat all winter long. I went over to his house the other day and uh, went to pick this thing up and I actually got it to fire up right away. But noticing the, to start this thing, it was very complicated as far as which way the choke was on and which way the choke was off. This shows the choke here, but it, you don't know what's on and what's off. And unless you've done two cycles all your life, you would not know. All right, so you have the choke is here, you have a primer bulb here, and of course you want to use that too. This is a two cycle, so I think this is the year 4151 mix. Make sure you mix it right. First thing I want, you, I want to show you here is if you take your air filter off, you can always take the little felt air filter out and look to see inside the air cleaner. I'm going to flip this choke on. I flip the choke on, it literally put a, a, a piece here, a little bracket that actually closes off the throat of the carburetor and now the choke is on. So if you need to know how the when the choke is on, you can take your air filter out, push the knob one way or the other, that's off and that's on. And then once you figure that out, then you'll be able to start a lot easier. I would put a little mark on your outside of your cover here that says on and off so you know for next time because you really can't tell by those it's really hard sometimes the manuals do help you out which helps all right so we're gonna have a couple things here you have an on off button this is not spring loaded and you have to know which way is on and which way is off it doesn't tell you which way is on and which way is off but i always say the circle is o for off the, the i uh i don't know but uh, yeah so anyway so on is down off is o so we're going to leave it on. You have a safety handle here, okay? The throttle, which is under here, will not move unless your hand's on the safety trigger. Once you put your hand on the safety trigger, you also have another button here. This is like the half throttle button. This is a very good button. They should Every two cycles should have one, as far as my opinion goes, because it really helps you start them. So what you want to do is you put your hand on the throttle, okay? But you got to have a safety switch down. Hand on the throttle all the way up, and then push the button in let go of the throttle while the button's still in. Now, this is set at half throttle. So this throttle is now, the throttle is actually up halfway. The button's in, we're set at half throttle. That's the way we want to start it. Come over to your choke. Choke is down, or forward on this one. And you have a primer bulb. You can prime it one, two, three primes. Make sure your on and off is on, which it is. Now, I'm gonna pull this until it pops. As soon as you hear it pop, you take the choke off, and you're going to probably pull it a couple more times, and it should fire up. Okay, so choke's on. We've primed it. Switch is on. We're set at half, we're set at half speed. Okay, so it just ran, and it stopped. So now you take choke off. Now it should run, and then you're going to flip the lever up, your little throttle up, and then let it go, and it'll bring it down to idle. And sometimes you just have to let them idle to warm them up. So that's pretty much how I start all two cycles. This is actually very nice that you have the uh, button on the side to make it go half throttle. So again, real quick, make sure it's on. Choke is down. Prime it a couple times. Throttle up. And then push the, the button in on the side while it's up. Then let go of the throttle. That sets it at half speed. Now since this started once, it may not need the choke. We'll just give it one pull. Now we take the choke off. One more pull or two pulls. Three pulls. That's pretty much how you start a two cycle steel HF HS45. Thanks for watching.